Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Can you state for me for the record? What? Can you give can you state your name for the record? Uh my name is Chen Su Ru. You can call me Christina. Uh I'm sixteen years old and you know, in grade eleven. Um I'm studying in Beijing number twelve high school. Do you know our school? Beijing number twelve high school. No, tell me about Beijing number twelve high school. Okay, our school is one of the best public high school in Beijing. We have the high quality education. Of course, our teachers uh, had higher educations too, so they are knowledgeable. Maybe our school is not very large, but the students and the teachers in our school are just like a big family. Um, if there is someone in trouble, the others will will uh, are willing to help him. And you know, if Chinese students want to go to the college, they need they need to take a test called Gaokao. Um, and most students graduate from our school are go to the Tsinghua, Beida, some college like like this. And we have a lot of activities, so I think my school life is very amazing. Okay, very good. Good, Christina. So I, I heard that you are in grade twelve. You said you're. Oh, uh, grade eleven. I'm sorry. Correction. Grade eleven. You're sixteen years old right now. What is your date of birth? What? What day were you uh, born? July ninth. July ninth. What year? Two thousand. Two thousand. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now, Christina, you're in grade eleven right now. Are yeah. you looking to repeat grade eleven in America, or are you looking to uh, uh, go to grade Zeta? eleven? Repeat grade eleven. Okay, I think that's yeah. a great idea. I'll I'll tell you later why. Um, because I think. Um, if I go to the America to study, uh, to, in grade eleven, I can more, I can get more time to study and to improve my English. Uh, you know, English is the second language for me, and if I study in Beijing, I can improve my English as well as in America. You know, people in China use Chinese to communicate with each other, so we have just a little time to speak English. Also, we when I was a young girl, I have been to America with my father. You know, just traveling. At that time, I find a lot of differences be between China and, uh, and America. You know, like the culture, the education, the food, the people. So I told my father when I grow up, I want to study overseas in America. I think for me, uh, it's the first dream. So if I go to America earlier and uh, have more time to. Stay with Americans. I can improve my English, and uh, I maybe I can make more new friends with people from different culture and countries, and know more know more about America. Okay, very good. Now, Christina, I, I want you to do me a favor, and whatever if you have, uh, I see that you are very prepared for the interview, and I appreciate that. But let's make this more conversational. Yeah, this this interview. What? What? So I will, uh, yeah, I will. I, I, I can't hear you clearly. Sorry. Okay, that's okay. Uh, what I want to ask you now, you told uh -huh. me a little bit about what happens. Uh, can you tell me why you want to study in America? Uh, just because I really love America and uh, I can make more friends with some people from different culture and countries. Uh, and are really interested in the culture in America, the food in America. Uh, I really want to improve my English. Okay, good. improve English. Very good. Have you ever been to America before? Yeah, 
Last year, I have been to America to study in Jenison High Public High School with my classmates. How long? How long were you in this public school? Uh, about one month. One month. Excellent. And you were in the class with the American students, or mostly with your, with your no, own uh, Chinese classmates. No, with classmate? American students. And what is the name of this school again? Jenison High School. Can you spell that? J E N I S. Uh, let me see. Uh, J E N I S O N. Jenison High School. What was the location of yeah. this high school? Michigan. Michigan. Wow. Okay. W when? When was this? Uh, One month. About last year, um, January to February. Wow, so you spent one month in the heart yeah. of winter in Michigan. Yeah. Okay. Did you think it was colder than Beijing or? Yeah, it's colder than Beijing. And oh. I've... Uh, last year, I lived at my host family. Family. Okay, tell me, did you, how did you like it, the weather in Michigan? Mm, because there always snowing, uh, but in Beijing, there is seldom snowing, and uh, I think we can play some like snowball and uh, without uh, with my friends in Michigan. But in Beijing, there is seldom snow. But uh, so, uh, you know, I like winter because the snow and uh, um. Uh, so you like the Michigan weather better? Yes. Very good. Okay, so tell me, I'm interested to know more about your host family. Tell me more about them. My host family. Um, my, my mom is called Rachel and my father is Brown. And I have a sister called Sarah and Delilah. Uh, they are friendly to me, friendly to me, and I lived with them. Uh, I lived with the. Oh, we always go to go shop go go shopping go uh, went shopping with I I I always went shopping with them and, uh, they always took me to travel to some places. Good. Okay, uh, okay. Go, go ahead, continue. Uh, and when I study at home, they always teach me some, some knowledge, like I don't know how to solve the problem. Uh, they help me a lot. Okay, good. Christina, have you ever taken the TOEFL? Yeah, what was last your score? year. What was your score on the TOEFL? Uh, the first time is just 60. And then? Um, and then, oh, this, this Saturday I will t take the TOEFL test. That was before or after the one month in Michigan? Your TOEFL? Uh, no. After go to Michigan. After Michigan. Yeah. Michigan. Okay. Have you been to any other place? Did have you been to any other places in America? Uh no. Okay, just Michigan. Did they take you? Did you go yeah. to see Chicago and any of the other uh, Midwest cities? No, because we just study in Jenison. Oh, okay. Okay, that's good. Uh, so, tell me, Christina, 
Who has been the most influential person in your life? Um, I think uh, that's my psychology teacher called Rachel. Uh, it was at the time when I was studying at primary school. Uh, during that time, I was pretty quiet and not willing to talk much with others. Uh, however, I still want to be a good friend, good good friend with my classmates. But one day, when I was hiding behind a tree and watching other students playing as usual, I felt a force on my back, which pushed me to the place where the students were playing. It was my teacher, you know, Rachel. She gave me a push and asked me, uh, asked my class, uh, classmates to play with me. Then I had a good time laughing and uh, playing all day along. Um, and I found, I found, uh, find out that it was much more easier than I thought to communicate with others. Okay, now I do not there. need. Christine, I'm going to stop you there. Uh, only because okay. I, I understand. Uh, I understand about uh, Rachel, I, but uh, I want this interview to be more conversational, right? Just talking. Okay. Okay, so you can put okay. the paper away. It's okay. Your English is fine. Okay, so relax. Uh, you. Yeah, your English is already very good. So relax, put the paper away. I just want to, uh, I want you to just talk to me, okay? Okay. Okay, very good. So uh, I, I learned more about Rachel. Now I want to learn more about what are your dreams and aspirations okay remember don't read i know you've prepared something but just uh tell just uh, share share with me okay um my dream um in the future i really want to set up my own firm because i'm interested in business so i really want to be a Business woman, um, and also I really interested in acting because I was a member of our school TV station. I'm the host of, uh, I'm a host and a reporter in my school, um, and I I'm the leader in. Our oh no! I organized a, a BPC business uh, club in our school. I'm the leader. Um, so I always organize our stu our members to sell something like the bears, the toys. Uh, it is wear our school uniform, and we sell it in our school. Very good. What okay. was it that you sold again? What? You sold bears, teddy bears? Yes, teddy bears. We, uh, it wears our school uniform. Oh, wow. Okay, very good. How much money did you make from, I mean, would you consider it successful or? I think it's successful because we always earn a lot of money to share our members. Good. Good. Good, Christine. So tell me, what other hobbies do you have? You like, uh, you, I, mm -hmm. I sense that you like organizing, uh, organizing people, becoming a leader in the community, but, and you like singing and acting. Uh, so yeah. tell me, what other, what other hobbies do you have? Um, you know, I was... Uh, running player when I was seven years old. Um, I trained in a high school, high school track team. Um, but after three years, I hurt myself, so I must give it up. Um, you know, but I, uh, but, you know, now I really, I still like running when I, after school or sometimes uh, some free times I, re I, I still love running. Uh, also, I like skateboard. You know, I always go to school by skateboard. Oh, really? Yeah, I love it. And I think um, 
When I was young, I learned playing the piano,、um, and just three years old, my mom took me to took me to learn how to swim. So I think I can swim very well. Very good.、Um, how how about how about、uh, since since you're very active, do you like Do you like、uh, going to sports sports events? Sports events, yes. Do you like watching basketball? Ah,、uh, uh, yes. I always playing basketball after school with some boys. You know. Wow.、Mm. You beat them. Yeah. Very good. If you come to America, are you interested in playing on the girls' team? Uh, maybe. Very good.、Uh, maybe I will. Okay, so you'll play. You'll play basketball for the school team. You will join in the theater, and you will join in the、uh, journalism, right? So broadcasting. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you have a lot to contribute to the school, then, yes. Yeah. Very good. That's what I like to hear. Okay, so have you considered any? Have you considered going to college? Yeah, sometimes. Okay, and there are a lot of majors that you might be interested in because you have a lot of hobbies, and you want to be your own business owner, and you want to、uh, you're interested in acting and journalism. Which major do you think you'll you'll take up? Maybe marketing, marketing. because I really like to sell sell my own pre uh what. How to say?、Uh, products. Oh yeah,、uh, products to everyone, and maybe I will study marketing or acting because、good. you know I I oh I worked at my uh worked at school TV station you know now、right. so maybe I will learn how to acting. Acting or like some business in marketing. Very good. Okay. Very good. Very good, Christina. So you've been to America before. You've been Michigan for a month.、Uh, you know a little bit about America. Which area do you prefer? Do you want West Coast, East Coast? Do you want to stay in that Michigan area where it's very cold? Washington D.C. You have、uh, there's so many there's so many places there's so many cities in America, or do you have a specific state in mind?、Uh, Michigan,、mm. New Jersey, maybe California, maybe New York. Okay, East Coast then. Yeah,、um, because I think it's similar as Beijing. Uh, it's a beautiful city, and actually, I can go shopping. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Okay, so tell me about what kind of school you want. Are you looking for a big school, small school? Uh huh. Um, maybe I want to go to a big school because there are a lot of people in there. Um, so I can make more friends, for uh, you know, the people from a different culture, different countries, uh, and uh, maybe the good、uh, the big school have a lot of activities like some sport activities or some voluntary uh community services. So. The activities I can, the more activities I can take part in. Jeez, okay, I agree with you. Yeah, I, I definitely agree with you. Excellent.、Uh, are you interested in 
Girls only schools? Uh, no. Must be co-ed then. Uh-huh. Co-ed. Uh, because I think if the school have only girls, there is no boys. <laughs> Maybe I can find boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, I, 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 I really enjoyed the honesty. Excellent. Okay, Christina. Uh, I've, mm -hmm. I had a, a, this was a wonderful conversation. I'm going to stop the recording, okay? But I want you to stay online. Uh, yeah. Okay, hang on.